In the bustling city of Tehran, in the year 1938, a girl named Farah was born. Her journey took her from the classrooms of Tehran and Paris to the grandeur of Iran's royal court, becoming Empress Farah Pahlavi. She married Shah Mohammad Reza Pahlavi in 1959 and ascended to the throne eight years later. As empress, she championed education, health care, women's rights, and the arts. However, her reign was not without controversy. The modernization efforts and Western influence of the Shah's regime sparked discontent. By some, Farah was seen as a symbol of extravagance and westernization. The year 1979 marked a pivotal moment. The Iranian Revolution forced Farah and the Shah into exile. They sought refuge in Egypt, Morocco, France and the United States. Despite these trials, Farah continued her advocacy for human rights and democracy in Iran, establishing the Farah Pahlavi Foundation to empower women and children. Today, Farah Pahlavi's legacy is complex. She is a figure of admiration for some, criticism for others, yet her elegance, intelligence and resilience are undeniable. This, dear listeners, is the story of Farah Pahlavi, the last queen of Iran.